guys today I have yet another Lush haul for you because that's where I went today because I was running low Liverpool was absolutely jam-packed today and um, the Lush store in particular was rammed I mean they actually just put my basket down and came out um, but I decided to basically stick with it push me through the crowd and I did make a few cheeky little purchases from Lush uh, the first things I got were products that I think are actually quite new in there, even though I know the Oxford Street um, store had them uh, for a while, and they are the bath melts. Um, the first one that I've got is this little one called Razzle Dazzle. This is super sweet, and I believe you put them in the bath when you when you get in the bath, and they basically leave the water all like really like soft and full of like essential oils. And then the next one that I got was um, with the mango wrapped in this squeeze proof paper for me. And that's what this one looks like. It's super, super, super citrusy. It smells a bit like um, avo bath to me. So the next one that I bought, so these don't have labels on, so hopefully I remember the name, um, is first hand out which is this gorgeous bright yellow colour I've had this one before now my nose seems to be running at the moment so this is bomb this isn't probably going to help me sniffing all these bath bombs this is very very citrusy that one next one that I've got let's see what's in here is intergalactic which is this one one of my favourites smells of peppermint oil leaves your bath all these different colours um, your bath goes like pink and purple and blue and then it looks like a night sky and you can see like um, glittering that looks um, like the night sky and it is absolutely amazing if you haven't tried Intergalactic out it is one of my absolute favourites next bath bomb that I got was um, Luxury Pud that's what this one looks like and this one again just has a variety of colours in your bath and it's just absolutely amazing. It looks easy, you can see a little holly and ivy at the top and then it's just got this pink and white with all these polka dot colours on. I can't get it in that bloody bag. I'm actually covered when you do these lush videos, I just get covered in lush, good, lush stuff. <laughs> Um, next one that I got was a bubble bar, and it's the Bar Humbug bubble bar, which is much smaller than the usual bubble bars that I do. This smells, this has got a hint of licorice in, well it's not licorice, it's fennel, um, which smells like licorice. And I love that, that smell. There's a, um, a pair of Hindergood Skies Old Overdose, which, which I really, really like, and that's, that's um, got an undertone of licorice in. And even though I can't stand licorice, I do like the smell of oh, licorice sweets. No, no. Next one that I've got is Yoga Bath Bomb. This is sell it's bright orange. It's got blue inside it. And it just smells absolutely amazing. And the last bath product that I got, the last lush product that I got, was Avo Bath, which is this one, this just smells amazing. This is what the Yubin Mango smells like to me. So that was my Lush haul. Um, only a small one this month. I didn't get lots of stuff. Um, but I did make another little cheeky purchase, um, which I'm super, super excited about. And I'll just get it now. And that is from Jo Malone. I decided that I was going to treat myself to a little purchase from Jo Malone. Um, I love the way they wrap things up. I've actually opened this already, so she didn't wrap it like this. I put this bow on, that's why it's probably not, not good. But I decided to get a perfume. This was £42. And the perfume I got was the Lime Basil and Mandarin. This is Jo Malone's signature scent. I'm just dropping it on the floor. Um, so, yeah, this is what they're known for. I'm not going to spray it because I'm about to go and get a bath in a minute. So, yeah, that's um, the perfume that I got. My favourite perfume of all time is from Jo Malone. 
and that is or was black vesiva uh, which has a very strong coffee smell to it which I absolutely loved um, but they've discontinued it sadly and there was nothing there that I personally thought was uh, the same to it and um, so I went with the signature one line basil and mandarin so that's my little lush haul and my little Joe Malone haul for you guys hope you're having um, a lovely weekend it's um, only six days to Christmas and I'm super super excited my mum just gave me some money to go and get a Christmas duvet um, so that's now on my bed so I love when you get new duvet covers and put them on and get in bed and clean pyjamas clean duvet covers it's just a cosy isn't it which is what you want for Christmas so uh, which is what you want not only Christmas but in winter or any time of the year any time you can be cosy really it doesn't really matter I'm just rambling on now anyway guys I shall love you and leave you and I shall see you all soon bye